Okay, so Harley, just tell us again, we've seen you at awards before, but what does it feel like to win this gold award today? Um, it's, a, it's, it's a real honour to, to win the awards. Um, got a silver last year, so I was really happy with that and I didn't expect to get put forward again for an, an award because obviously it's a, a national award so it's quite a big thing. So to, to even be put forward two years in a row is like a massive achievement and I was happy with that but to win it is amazing. And you're a great teacher and you're training on our tutor training programme as well yeah. but you're now looking towards coaching. Yeah. Why the changes or the addition of coaching? Um, to be honest, the reason why I got into coaching is because I've been teaching for quite a while now and some of the kids that you know, I've talked to swim from scratch who I started teaching for four or five years ago were getting to an age where you know, they, they, their next step was to go into a coaching environment. Um, so originally I would send them over to, uh, this is all happening at the Aquatic Centre in Stratford, I would send them over to Lisa Bates, who's the head coach of the performance programme, um, and I sent quite a few kids over and uh, she was quite happy with the level of, of swimmers I was sending over to, to go into her programme. Um, and then eventually I applied and she was more than happy to take me on as a coach and I thought, yeah, I'd really like to bridge the gap between learning to swim and going into that coaching environment. So that's where I sort of sit within coaching is, you know, not at the top level, but trying to get swimmers who have learned to swim and have got the correct skills to first go into their coaching environment and hopefully succeed and win competitions.